what on YouTube, this is Sam from Team Samurai X1 here, and today guys, I'm coming at you with my Spyro deck profile for the post November 6, 2017 ban list, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and of course guys, as I progress to the deck profile, I'll be explaining to you guys some of my card choices, and the reasons why I play them, and although that this deck did get hit on the ban list with the limitation of Spyro Quick Fix, and also the limitation of Spyro Gear Drone, this deck is still 100% functional, it's still compatible, and it's still going to be one of the best decks in today's metagame. Quick fix going to one and also drone going to one makes the deck a little bit slower, okay? But we still have three terraformings, we still have three resorts, and instead of using machine duplications now, we're gonna be implementing cards like double summon into the deck rather than using machine dupes. Uh, so the deck is still 100% functional, and, and you can make crazy boards first turn just like before. But the deck and with the release of the new Cyber's Link structure deck, we now have access to Trigate Wizard, which now we can negate cards like Evenly Match and also cards Regeki, any cards that basically tries to board wipe you. You can actually use Trigate Wizard to negate. So I'll showcase you guys the deck profile and through the end of the video, I'll showcase you guys an amazing two card combo that you guys can do with this deck. And if you guys want to help support the channel, I have a brand new Spiral Playmat available. If you guys want to help support the channel, make sure you guys get your Spiral Playmat today. I do free shipping to Canada and USA. International shipping may cost extra. Channel, make sure you guys get your Spiral Playmats today. Start off with the monsters real quick, you're gonna play of course the one spiral quick fix and also the one spiral gear drone. Quick fix one and one definitely slow down the deck a little bit, but you still have spiral resort to get you access to this card as quickly as possible. And with quick fix going to one, you have to be really careful on the way you utilize its secondary effect in the graveyard because once it leaves the field, this card will be forever banished. So you're gonna be using this card uh, from the graveyard and then using it to overlay for your rank one XC's plays and then constantly uh, abusing its secondary effect in the graveyard, which is really amazing. So you can still abuse quick fix. Uh, which is really good in the deck. Spiral Gear Drone uh, was one of the best cards in the deck because, you know, if you don't open up Quick Fix or Machine Dupe, that you can still open up, you know, Gear Drone and Spiral Super Agent. That combo is still viable because you still have Triple Resort to actually search out the Gear Drone and also get access into your Super Agent as quickly as possible. And you guys will know that the Drone and Agent combo uh, basically gives you a first turn Spiral Sleeper. Next turn to play, of course, Triple Spiral Super Agent. This card is absolutely amazing. You guys don't know what it does. You call the right card on top of your opponent's deck. You destroy a Spawn Trap card your opponent controls. Having access to Triple Agent is not even that bad at all because you are playing double summon the deck you can just actually double summon basically go off into your helix place which is really really good so triple super agent next turn play of course the one spiral tough i think this card is actually pretty good in the deck it helps destroy any problematic monster on the board and also gives you access to any information that your opponent has on top of their deck and it gives you free information on what card is on top of your opponent's deck which is really really uh beneficial as well so and it's a level four monster which gives you access into number 41 one last resort, uh, one spiral master plan, very standard, the card that you'll never want to draw. And last but not least for the spiral monster you're going to play in the deck is uh, the one spiral sleeper. Sleeper is, you know, your boss monster in the deck. You get this card out, you basically just win the duel. Uh, so that's pretty much it for the spiral engine, guys. Let's go off into your supporting engines. Next turn to play, of course, the one, the Strudel, the Lost Dragon Frenzy. I, I still think this card is actually really good to actually help you make Black Rose to help nuke the board and also make Ancient Fairy Dragon to pop cards to Dragon Review to get access to your resort. It's just absolutely amazing. So I want the Strudel is really good. Most of the time, I usually use the Strudel to actually extend my combo plays even further so that way I, I can make even bigger boards than I already have before. So uh, the one, the Strudel is just a really good card to have access to uh, Ancient Fairy Dragon and also the Black Rose. Next on to the Hand Traps, 100% guys, Triple Ash Blossom. This card is going to be one of the best Hand Traps again this deck. I don't think that Drone Lockbird is going to be really good anymore in the main deck because Machine Duplication is now gone and you don't have the abuse uh, effect of Quick Fix multiple times in one turn. Uh, you know what I mean? Although that you can still, you know, abuse Quick Fix and things like that, you know, the one Quick Fix, I still think that Ash Blossom basically accomplishes the same thing as Drone Lockbird. What you do is that, you you know, as soon as you summon Quick Fix, you boom, you Ash Blossom. The correct play 100% is always save the Ash Blossom for the Double Helix. So once your opponent summons the Double Helix, you're definitely just going to Ash Blossom them. And if they have no other combo extenders, you basically just are, are able to freely go off within the following turn to try to OTK them. So Ash Blossom is definitely you know one of the best cards uh, in today's metagame so far. And next off, guys, in replaces of Drone Lockbird, I think this card is really good uh, since the limitation of Spiral Quick Fix and also Gear Drone, especially against the Mirror Match, is uh, definitely Ghost Ogre and Snow Rabbit. They're now more reliant on actually resolving cards like Resort, so resolving cards like uh, Ravine, res resolving cards like Helix. I think that Ghost Ogre is just really good against that. Having Quick Fix and also Drone at 1 makes the deck a little bit slower, so having cards like Ghost Ogre to basically stop their effects is just really amazing. The main key thing that you want to Ghost Ogre is definitely Ghost Ogre Helix's effect. Uh, so that way that your opponent is forced to add the monster uh, to the hand instead of specialing the monster. 
sometimes as a spiral player, you're just so reliant on actually resolving cards like Resort. Uh, so hitting the Resort can actually be really beneficial uh, with cards like Gold Soldier. So Gold Soldier can become really powerful since the limitation of uh, Spire Quick Fix and also Gear Drone. So definitely recommend you guys mainly at least two Gold Soldiers in my opinion. Uh, the one Maxi, uh, best card in the game, and of course the one DD Crow, because you can actually get access to this card directly from your deck to your hand off Recital Starling. Very standard card, Triple Spiral Resort. This card is one of the best cards in this deck. Being able to search out any Spiral Monster directly from your deck to your hand it's just really amazing and the key fact is that it recycles and basically your opponent cannot target any of your spiral cards as long as this card is on the field so resort is super broken uh so as long as this card is still at three i believe that this deck is still uh pretty functional in today's metagame one spiral mission assault this card is really good mainly to use the secondary effect to banish itself to special in a spiral monster for your hand uh which i'll explain you guys the combo with this card later on so this card is really important uh double um you know, Spiral Gear, Big Red. Big Red is just really good to actually help you extend your combo plays and turn buy back any of your Spiral Monster for a greater art so that way that you have uh, your Helix plays are just really good. So double Big Red. Next off for the Searchers, we're going to play, of course, Triple Terraforming. Terraforming basically gets you access to your Spiral Resort as quickly as possible. You want to open up Resort as quickly as you can so that way that you can basically combo off. So Terraforming is great. And, of course, the One Dragon Ravine for the, you know, for the Destrudo, which is really nice. So... Next off for our combo extenders, we're going to play, of course, Triple Double Summon. Double Summon is just really good. In the OCG, they definitely prefer Double Summon over Machine Duke because... Because Machine Duke can actually get Ash Blossom, so uh, you know already double able to help you dodge Ash Blossom, which is really really great. So Double Summon is really good. You need this card now. I, I recommend you guys play this card at three, is because it's one of your main combo extenders in the deck. You want to have access to your Helix as quickly as possible, especially first turn, so that way that you can set up your Unbreakable board with Trigate Wizard and things like that. Next off, Soul Charge. You guys open Soul Charge. You guys are winning that duel. 100%. A 1-1-4-1 one, one, one gets you access to your quick fix and drone directly from your deck as quickly as possible as well, uh, which is really nice. A uh, 1 Foolish Burial, you know, same purpose. These cards are just all really powerful uh, one I was in a deck like foolish one for one really powerful uh, double foolish burial goods you are playing uh, the mission assault as well so you can actually activate foolish burial goods dump uh, mission assault to the graveyard banish mission assault to special in a spiral monster from your hand uh, which is really nice so this card basically extend your combo plays as well you can also dump uh, spiral mission rescue to the graveyard to revive back cards a quick fix from your graveyard so you can keep abusing its effect and last but not least I decided just to make one regeki to actually help you clear problematic boards that your opponent makes which is nice so the one right gate to round off our spell. Off to your traps, of course, double uh, spiral mission rescue and uh, one spiral gear utility wire to round off our traps. Very standard traps. Quick fix gives you access to this card. You usually make a board of sleeper and set this. You're pretty much just winning that game already. And this card is actually able to help you extend your combo plays, which is really, really nice. So let's go after the side real quick. Very standard side, triple uh, gold sweeper and winter cherries and the one ABC dragon buster. You're also playing, uh, you know, the helix in the main, of course. So you can actually side reaper in against the mirror match for the ABC matchup. These cards on auto win. Playing cards like Call it Cyclone. It's really good against Magician, especially against the Trap, in my personal opinion. So next, you're playing, of course, again, Triple yeah, Evenly Match. Really good against Rogue, and basically really good against any deck that uh, tries to spam the board. Very standard side, up, uh, side deck stuff. And last but not least, for going first cards, you're playing cards like Artifact Lancia to combat against Evenly Match, Artifact Scythe, and uh, Triple Artifact Sanctum to go first against the Mirror Match as well. Uh, so you, as long as you open up an Artifact Sanctum or uh, Artifact Lancia and things like that, you're basically... Um, protected from cards to evenly match which is really good so artifact all right guys off to the extra deck the standard you know double helix very powerful double firewall dragon help you extend your combo plays trigate wizard the new addition to the deck this card is really amazing basically a solemn judgment if you have three cold link cards to it which you can make easily and i'll showcase you guys a combo uh, throughout the end of the video so make sure you guys stay tuned for that trigate wizard really powerful card help can help can, can actually help ultk as well which is good uh deco talker uh, Borrelo Dragon helps you uh, get rid of uh, the Spiral Sleeper, which is nice. Proxy Dragon, uh, the one in, one guy's Saber, the Lightning Shadow. That's pretty much it for all the Link monsters that you are playing in the deck. Uh, Princess Sprite, uh, Recital Starling helps you search out uh, DD Core directly from the deck to your hand. And also, uh, Princess Sprite can also help you get access into your spell cards uh, or trial cards directly from your deck to your hand as well if you milled it, which is nice. One Baguska. Uh, one Ancient Fairy Dragon, and of course, the one Black Rose Dragon for the Dustrudo. Uh, Black Rose is just really good to help you clear problematic boards. And Ancient Fairy Dragon can help you pop a ravine to get you access to the resort as quickly as possible. So that's pretty much it for the extra deck, guys. Let's go off into the combo real quick. 
All right, guys, so let's go off to the two-card combo real quick. So all you guys need for your opening hand is a resort and a double summon, which you are playing six copies of resort in your deck because you're playing triple terraforming and also triple resort. And you're also playing triple copies of double summon in the deck. So you're trying to maximize yourself on actually drawing these two cards as quickly as possible so that way that you can have this combo. So what you're going to do first is you're not going to be smart resort. Okay, uh, to basically search out your spinal quick fix directly from your deck to your hand. You're going to normal summon quick fix. Activate quick fixes effect to search the spiral gear drone directly from your deck to your hand. All right. So now what you're going to do is you're going to activate double summon to basically grant you the uh, the additional normal summon again. So you're going to normal summon, of course, the spiral gear drone. And now what you're going to do is that you're going to activate spiral gear drone's effect to basically stack your opponent's top three cards in the deck. And after you've done that, you're going to know the correct card on the top of your opponent's deck, of course. And then you're going to... You know, send these two cards to the graveyard right here to basically summon the spiral double helix directly from uh, your extra deck. Like, since you know the top card of your opponent's deck, since you stacked it with drone, especially summon uh, master plan, you're gonna activate her effect to search the spiral mission rescue. After this, what you're gonna do next is that you're gonna activate spiral quick fix effect in the graveyard to pitch spiral mission rescue to the graveyard to special summon spiral quick fix to your side of the field. Once spiral quick fix special summon, you're gonna search the spiral gear big red directly from your deck to your hand. All right, so you have big red. Next, you're gonna use helix and master plan. Send these two cards to the graveyard to link summon into your deco talker now trigger off master fans effect since you use it to link summon you're going to search the spiral super agent directly from your deck to your hand and of course another spiral resort so this is your hand so far now what you do next is that you can activate of course spiral gear big red to revive back the gear drone directly from your graveyard okay so revive back gear drone now what you do next is that you're going to activate super agents effect to basically call the uh the right card that you stacked on top of your opponent's deck to special limit of course the spiral super agent so this is your current board right here you have a super agent you have quick fix drone and you will also have a resort in hand and also another resort on the field okay, now what you're gonna do is that you're gonna activate miss and rescue to banish miss and rescue from the graveyard put this in your manage pile to special them back spiral master plan directly from your graveyard now you're gonna activate master plan to basically search your second copy of mission rescue directly from your deck to your hand so this is your hand right now so these two cards right here quick fix and gear drone you want to make a first turn recital starling now what you're going to do with Recital Starling is that you're going to detach an XYZ material from this card to search a DDD crow directly from your deck to your hand. Now what you're going to do is that you're going to use Decode Talker and also Recital Starling. Send these two cards to the graveyard to basically Link Summon. So you Link Summon into a Firewall Dragon. Now what you're going to do is that you're going to activate Quick Fix Effect in the graveyard to basically send the mission that you have in your hand to the grave to special summon the Quick Fix. Once Quick Fix is special summon, you're going to activate Quick Fix Effect to basically search your Spiral Gear Last Resort directly from your deck to your hand. Now what you're going to do is that you're going to use Super Agent and of course Master Plan to send these two cards to the graveyard to basically link summon into your Double Helix, your second Double Helix. Since Firewall Dragon pointed to Spiral Master Plan and Master Plan was sent to the graveyard, you're going to activate Firewall Dragon's Effect to special summon the DD Crow from your hand. Now using DD Crow and also Quick Fix, what you're going to do is that you're going to overlay these two for Sylvan Princess Sprite. Now what you're gonna do is that you're gonna activate Sylvan so Princess Sprite effect to basically mill the top card of your deck. Let's mill. Okay, so if you mill a Spiral's Resort, you're pretty much blessed. But let's just say that you mill a Resort, but you're not gonna use it. This card is like irrelevant, so you're just using its effect. So let's say you did have the Resort, I'm not gonna use it at all. Now what you're gonna do is that you're gonna activate your last Spiral Mission Rescue to banish the Special Summon, of course, the Master Plan. Once Master Plan is Special Summon, you're gonna activate Master Plan's effect one more time to search your Spiral Mission. Assault directly from your deck into your hand. Now what you're gonna do is that you're gonna activate Quick Fix Effect one more time. You're gonna send Mission Assault to the graveyard to special summon, of course, the Quick Fix. And Quick Fix Effect is gonna activate to search your Spiral Gear, your Totally Wire directly from your deck into your hand. So now what you're gonna do is that you're gonna activate your second copy of Spiral Resort. Okay, so it's the one you search off the master plan to search a spiral sleeper directly from your deck to your hand. So using effect, you search the spiral sleeper. Now what you're gonna do is that you're gonna activate Mission Assault's effect to banish Mission Assault to special summon to special summon a spiral monster from your hand. So since you have a resort in your hand, you're gonna special summon spiral last resort uh, using Mission Assault's effect. So this is your board right now. And now what you're gonna do is that you're gonna banish gear and of course a big red to add a super agent directly from a graveyard back into your hand. Use now, now what you're going to do is that you're going to use Double Helix and of course Last Resort, send these two cards to the graveyard to basically make your Trigate Wizard. Alright, so you made your Trigate Wizard. And now Firewall Dragon is going to trigger one more time to special summon of course the Super Agent from your hand. Now you're going to use Princess Sprite and of course Quick Fix to Link Summon again. Okay. And Quick Fix will get banished 100% to summon. So summon Ib. What you guys can do now is you guys can actually send these two cards to the graveyard to make your third 
double helix if you guys are playing a third but since i only play two double helix what i'm going to do with this situation is that i can either add a double helix for my graveyard back into my extra deck using the fireball dragon or i can just add a spiral gear uh last resort from your graveyard back into my hand but if you were playing a if you're playing a third helix that means that your spiral gear utility wire will become live but for this video's sake since i don't play a triple helix what i'm going to do at this point is that i'm going to use these two cards right here to the graveyard to make a proxy dragon okay right here which is really crucial so that way that trigate wizard will gain its third effect and now what i can do is that i'm gonna add use firewalls dragons effect to uh, bounce back a card from a griever back into your hand and the card i'm going to bounce back is of course the last resort and now i'm going to banish three cards from my graveyard three spiral cards from my grave right here to basically summon of course uh, my spiral sleeper so i summon the sleeper activate resorts effect equip it to the sleeper and now i have another card from princess sprite in my hand if i you know melt a spawn trap and I have a utility wire for the following turn. But if you guys are playing a triple double helix uh, in your extra deck, this proxy dragon will be a double helix instead of uh, instead of the proxy dragon, of course. But either way, this board is still really powerful. You have a resort sleeper that can kill two cards on the board. You basically have an unbreakable board right here, uh, which is really nice. And you also have a trigate wizard, which has the ability to basically negate anything. All right, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button. And hopefully you guys enjoy the combo and this is Sam from Team Sam Sam signing out. Alright guys, peace. Friends of the family, yeah. Do it for the friends of the family. Who else? Friends of the family, yeah. Do it for the friends of the family. Friends of the family. Do it. You don't know them, you don't know me, dang.